Pathibara Limbu Cultural Trail on road Kanchanjanga. Kanchanjanga is the third highest mountain of the world. The 8,586 meter tall Kanchanjanga Himal is situated in the Taplejung district in the northern Flora and fauna decorate the variety of land features of this region. In an area of 3,646 square kilometers, about 134,698 people reside. More than 64% of people who live here are involved in agriculture livestock, cottage industries and other local occupations. The weather remains pleasant throughout the year, with the average temperature remaining between 11 to 30 degrees Celsius. Sometimes during winters and snowfall, the temperature may fall below zero degrees Celsius. On the lap of the Himalayas and the lush beauty also lies the temple of the much revered Pathibhara Devi. This temple is a holy and religious site for both Hindu and Buddhist pilgrims. Situated at an elevation 3,794 meters from sea level, in a juncture of Tapi Thok, Lim Kim and Pawakula village development committees, Pathibhara is about 19.4 kilometers from district headquarters of Fungling Bazaar. Numerous legends tell stories of the Pathibhara Devi. One such story explains how the Devi shrine originated. Myth has it that once a shepherd lost hundreds of a sheep at the very spot where the temple stands today. The shepherd then, while praying for his sheep, had a vision of the Devi. The Devi asked him to make a sacrifice for his sheep. After doing accordingly, the shepherd is believed to have found his lost sheep. Locals believe in the strength of the goddess and since then they started worshipping her as the wish-fulfilling goddess. The beautiful temple of Pathivara Devi is situated on top of Pathivara Hill, the shape of which resembles Pathi, the traditional Nepali utensil for measuring grain. In fact, it is from this peak that the goddess derives her name. There is also a Havan Kunda for Yagyas and other rituals. From the top of Pativara Hill, visitors can even observe the majestic Mount Kanchanjunga and other Himalayan peaks.
the trek to Pativara Devi shrine is an exhilarating experience, adventurous and breathtaking. The trail passes through a lush vegetation of Himalayan plants and rhododendron forests, alpine grass and orchids. If you are a bird lover, different varieties of singing birds can also be seen on the way. During the winters, pilgrims enjoy a four to five days trek in the snowfall. The best time to visit is from March to June and September to November. The Patibhara Limbu Cultural Trail starts from Fungling, the main bazaar of the district. Literally, in Limbu language, Fungling means the land of flowers. Fungling lies at a height of 1,824 meters. Fungling is linked with Birtamod Chapa by the Char Ali Ilam Fidim Taplejung Road. One can experience the beauty of the hilly region, Limbu culture, and the local market called Hat Bazaar. Besides a road trip to Fungling, Taplejung is accessible by flight from Kathmandu and Biratnagar to Suketar. Suketar is at an altitude of 2,840 meter. presence of strong cultural heritage. On the route, visitors can get homestay facilities where they stay with the local family, exchanging and learning the local lifestyle and culture. Lodges, guest houses and dharmashala are also available. Visitors enjoy the traditional Nepali dishes like dal, bhat, seasonal vegetables and tasty local snacks and drinks like tongba and angatrek provides an experience of the limbu culture of the Nepalese Himalayas. For visitors other than pilgrims, limbu cultural trek is equally enthralling. A week-long Limbu cultural trek passing through traditional villages like Furunga, Limkim, Kewang, Telok, Fawakola and Mamanke can be a visit worth remembering. En route are small Limbu hamlets and traditional settlements scattered on the broad hilly green landscape. Visitors are welcomed by the cheerful Limbu people adorned in traditional attire and jewelry with their cultural performances. Some of the traditional Limbu dances are the Dhan Naj for welcoming good news and happiness, Chebrum Naj on entering into new house or marriage, Bijua Naj for welcoming visitors, and Jhakri Naj to omit evil soul.
lagillo sine ni pa tello sine ma dai ko sine the colorful and rich limbu culture is an inherent part of the Taplejung trekking experience. Therefore, much work has been initiated by government and private sector to help preserve this culture. The highly revered Pathibhara Devi, the splendor of Mount Kanchanjunga, lush and a plenty flora and fauna, and the rich and interesting limbu culture are the main attractions of Taplejung. The treasure of this unexplored trekking route surely attracts visitors from far and wide. The region is just awaiting visitors like you and me to be a part of their cultural experience.